Hello and welcome. In our previous video, we had learned the basics of Open API specification by going through the Open API specification documentation or GitHub. If you have not watched that video, please check out the video. I will give the link in the card section. So in this video, we are going to create a simple or the basic API definition using OS for our company ABC that is to get the details of all the products. In order to do that, the basic things are uh, we want get HTTP method to be created for a particular API which is exposed over path slash product and the response will have the ID, name, description, price and warranty tags. So we are going to make use of this Swagger editor. First we will clear the editor. I will scroll down over to the flex fields. So first thing uh, I will make use of minimal flex fields in order to create the API. The first thing over here is defining the version. I will make use of 3.0. So this will instruct Swagger editor to perform all the validation as per this open API 3.0.0. So if you click on this control and space, you will get this pop up. So next what we are going to add is this info. Click on this. So again, if you press the control and the space, uh, you will get the list of options which you can make use of title I'm going to name this as ABC company API definition. Click on enter again. Uh, if you want, you can have a description over here. Creating api definitions for abc company using open api 3.0.0 now again if you want to add the contact details uh, you could do it over here or you can have the email id uh, i will add one dummy email id at the right uh, uh, abc company.com again if you want to add the uh, license details all those steps you can uh, add it over here as you can see on the right hand side uh, we are getting this uh, documentation that is the title ABC company API defini definition description. So the next flex field what we can add it over here is add the path directly. So if you go to this documentation open API is for the validation purpose we can uh, instruct the swagger editor or any other editor which we are comfortable with you can use. So I'll click on this path subject. Again I have to drill down to this path. We can define the path and uh, we have to go to this methods. So in our case our path is slash products. I'm making use of this. So here I'm making use of get as per our documentation we have to expose our products catalog for company ABC over get HTTP method and the response will consist of ID, name, description, price and the warranty. So under get I'm going to define the responses so under responses I will have a 200 status code. So the next thing uh, we have to define is a content type so I'm giving this as application slash uh, JSON. So there is this error uh, we, we will first resolve the error at the info page. Uh, that is over here over here and add the version i will version this api as 1.0.0 so before uh, defining a content if you want to add a description we can do it over here by adding the description tag i'm providing the description as to get to get all product details content is application uh, json this is fine then we can create a schema schema uh, it will have a uh, define the type as this is of type array under the array data type, uh, we are going to make use of properties and define the items. So the first thing over here is properties is an element of items. So I will add it over here and indent it properly. So under properties of the first element, what we need to create is an ID. So I'm creating an ID. Here we have to mention the type of the item which we created. It's of type integer. We can provide the example as well over here. Uh, this is of type uh, we are giving some example 100 so the next item in our response will be the name and its type will be string example i'm providing as ball and the good thing about editor is swagger editor is on the right hand side it will uh, show that a real time simulation for the documentation what we created so it has created as a get object over here a path parameter as a slash product and the response for the status code 200 uh, there is a documentation uh, the media type application json what we created over here and the sample uh, json object created with of type array so the next thing is description so the type is string this is cricket ball you can give some description for a product so the next thing is price uh, so the type of this price element is this is of type integer when you can have a float or double for simplicity i'm making use of this integer type price i'm giving as 30 rupees 
and the last thing is a warranty so it has created documentation for us uh, there is this error showing it is on this line typo with the example name we we'll correct this so with this we have corrected all the errors and created a basic api uh, doc definition for our uh, get product api for abc company so it's making use of oas uh, 3.0.0 version over here and based on that only all validations are happening so like this we can create a simple or uh, the basic api with the help of uh, swagger editor on os3 standards thank you for joining us in this video